a good play. I just don't, I don't, I don't know what was accomplished there. I know what is uh, getting accomplished here, and uh, that is uh, you're getting bossed, dude. And I got a land. Doesn't matter. Exact. Lethal. Delete it. Hello and welcome back to Bad Magic with the citrus fruit that is the only known survivor of the Titanic submersible implosion. Me, Moldy Kumquat. Now, today we are playing Mardu Humans. And for those of you that know me, you know that this is not the typical deck that I would play. However, I had so much fun with this deck. Um, we went 8-2, and two, which of course makes it a lot more fun. Nobody likes losing. And when you're winning, man, you're winning. So we went full Tiger Blood on this one. And I do think that you will enjoy it. The normal uh, players are involved here as far as aggro goes. Um, Inti was a champion. Uh, I played Ishin once, but it was cool when I played him. Mishra, though. Mishra, my god. Mm, mwah, 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 mwah. I, this is the first time I've played with this guy, and he was really freaking sweet. Anyway, before we get into the games, I just want to give you a reminder, if you have not subbed to the channel, like about 90% of you, please hit the sub below. It only takes a second, and make sure that you are hitting the notification bell, because I am going live now, and I would not want you to miss that. We are going to have so much fun in the days to come. Also, when you watch this, it's St. Patty's Day. So, happy St. Patrick's Day to you. I am prepared. I got green on, so don't you pinch me. Anyway, the time for talking is over. The time for playing is now. Um... <clears throat> Got us a turn two Thalia. Don't know how many times that's been done to me. It's going to be nice to do that myself. So he's not Convoke, but I'd like to draw land off the top here, please, Dick. Just one. That's all I need, just one. We're almost, this is almost like Mardu Legends, technically. Technically, what you gonna do, Hasio? I know you got a card that you wanna play, but you can't because Athali is there. And that's not a land. Um, do I don't want to discard a card? Yeah, we'll discard this bad boy. I'd like to have had the mana to do that. See how I do with aggro. It's not my cup of tea, even though I did go 16 and 0 with Boros Convoke. Not that hard. So I'm interested in what this guy is. Oh, hello. Hello. time. I don't care if he, he kills him. I'm 
I'm not sure how he thought that was going to go, but you know, maybe he just wanted to make sure he gave Baird the um, plus one, plus one. I do think we're in a good spot, though, here. Voice of the Blessed. Hmm. Hmm. Now your plan is shot. Yeah, you can block him. That's fine. But you are taking a lot of damage. Yes, sir. That is the idea of aggro is just attack mindlessly to their face. He's got this uneaten feast over here that they're trying to solve and he can't because he's not gaining any life. I've still got add a line up here that's a blocker until he, he kills it right now with a get lost that he pays three for maybe nope that's just a regular toe and he scoops game one baby let's go always goes first game it's like yeah and then you lose and it's like uh this is this land's gonna hurt think we're on the Boros path, which, I mean, technically we are, but a little different. Let's see what we're doing. That's all I got for you, bud. All right. Yeah, draw, draw cards. Draw them all. Just do nothing but draw cards, Kanu. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and get lost that. I was kinda hoping he would scoop there. He should have scooped. Unless an ill-timed explosion is about ready to hit me. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Goodbye. <sighs> yep. I should have known better. I should have known better. I should have known better. Obviously, I did know better. I mean, the fact that he's playing uh, is it here? I, I think I'm almost on the. I don't. I don't care what he has as a blocker as long as I can get the, okay never mind never mind never freaking mind I told you after game two we were going to be like the game one hype win game two hype winning and then here we are spell pierce Surely not. Okay. Hmm. 
No attacks. I mean, I still feel like it. Still feel pretty good about this. He can't use that Shiv and Reef. Not for blue or red. Okay. I mean, I can't do anything right now. That hearth elemental, and now another gin? Wow. Mm-mm-mm. We just have to go wider, right? That's our only option right now, is to just go super wide, and I can't right now. Hope he gets a little greedy here, maybe. I mean, I only need anything but the Luminous Phantom to get through. Come on, Connor, do something, do something dumb. you're on a blue-white control path. Ooh, that's nice. Let's bring down the Talia. Now, if I could just draw a land. Deck. Deck. Come on, deck. Really? You're really going to do this for me, or are you just setting me up to let me down? Are you really going to do this for me? Is that going for the Adeline? Or the Thalia? He's more scared of the Adeline, and I can't understand. Um... One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we just we just play uh, the daring traveler and keep on trucking. Keep on keeping on. There's the appraiser. He found the mentor. They've got some blockers. Let's go. play the claimed, the Gix claimed, he who has been claimed by Gix. Boom! Take that, hurts. That hurt. That really hurt. And you don't have enough, sir. Boom. One more. Boom. Good. Game. Mardu. Humans. Two and one. Let's go. Hmm. No, we just always keep it. Always keep it. That market gnome is going to prove 
to be an issue, I think. Oh, sweet Talia. Sweet, sweet Talia. Looks like he is also on the Mardu path. Oh, I need a land. We are going to... Why can't you be a land? An anvil. Interesting. And there goes the gnome. Okay. All right. Uh huh. Roscoe, what are you doing? You got a lot of shenanigans going on there, and I just want to land. I just want a land. Right? Just want to land. deck giveth and the deck taketh away <sighs> what are we even doing here it's all the adelines and no lands I only have a 45% chance to draw land you know I know it's less than 50% well when everything else is around the uh Let's see, nine percent for Anim Pakal, and that's it. Oh, there's a land. Okay. Net zero. <clears throat> That's fine. Wait a second. Yeah, no, never mind. Net one. The Vein Ripper. Oh, Lord have mercy. That is not good. That is not good. I like the, uh... Maybe we're... I like this. I like this back and forth here. A lot. I like it a lot. I think we're going to do it like this. Oh, yes. I'll take a land. I, I don't I, I think that vein ripper is gonna do me in I think the vein ripper is going to do me in I'm just not going to be able to oh Lord have mercy uh, let's just go to the next game I mean good game Roscoe it's that was that was cute 
the anvil and the vein ripper every single time two lands every single time all right let's get our thalia down that way he's going to struggle uh, we're going to play this and hope that we can draw a land from this. But what am I going to get rid of? No land. No land. That's fine. Every game has been like that. Every game. So. There you go. Ooh, I should have actually done the Talia. I have another one in my hand. That was stupid by me. We all learn. Sure. He has all the edicts. Now this way I can start just sacking tokens if he... Well, no, not with shield or edict. But we're definitely putting on some pressure and he is... Not in any range to sweep. Nor is he any any color to sweep. Um Yeah, let's do it like this. Let's just Oh, it didn't matter. It didn't matter. I wasn't even paying attention to his health. Three and two. Oh, one land. They were like, hold up here. You don't like two lands. We're going to give you one. But this is okie dokie right here. This is a okay. All right. So it's a race. Mono red. Didn't attack. Is he a real mono red player? No, he's not. See, we knew. No, I'm not going to block, because you're just going to pump him up, and I'll take that damage. Ali Benbala. Give him a pump. Give him a, give him a, a good pump. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Are we going to um, well, as long as I'm depending on you, then it looks like we're going to be watching it separately and giving our reviews at the end. I've tried for weeks. Cool story, bro. Cool story. That was, that was a, a nice big hit. That was a good hit. A good, good giant growth hit. This game, is this, is this card ever going to leave? What, do P, I, I'm confused that people still play it, actually. Okay. So he decided not to. I'm coming in, baby. Coming in. I will block with the roaming throne. Don't you worry. I will give you that block you're looking for. 
with the roaming throne. Because you, Ali Ben Bala, are sitting on two lands. And that does not scare me. Still does not, it scares me a little bit now. Scares me a little bit now. Scares me a little bit, but I think he should be scared because that was not enough to kill me. Not enough, but this should be enough. Good sir. Delete. I'd really like to have something on turn one, but beggars can't be cho choosers. Oh. It's probably playing mono red, so I don't want to take the damage. He's absolutely playing mono red, and he's got a uh, whatever that is. Do to. Oh no, it's a shock. Okay. Anything that hits my creatures does not hit my face. And I am fine with that. So is this just a mono red burn deck? Is that what is that what we're looking at here? If it is a mono red burn deck, then Again, anything that doesn't hit my face is a good thing. Is a good thing. Okay. Like he's he's desperate for some cards it looks like. Shock him now. Should have shocked him. And you can shock my copper coat, uh, copper coat vanguard now. <clears throat> but we get in there for three, and that's okay by me. Mm -hmm. Dude, this guy is fishing hard. Gotta have a shock or something. <sighs> okay. Fine. That is fine by me. Now, deck, give me a land so we can finish this game out. There's that shock. Okay. None of this is going to, towards my face, so what that means is that old dude is uh... Well, it's not a land, but I'll take it. Because it's pressure. Ah. <sighs> Yarr. Ooh. Wow. Just the, every move this guy is making just reeks of desperation. Just reeks of desperation. Like at, at, in what way, shape, or form was that a good play? I just don't. I don't. I don't know what was accomplished there. I know what is uh, getting accomplished here. And, uh, that is, uh, you're getting bossed, dude. And I got a land? Doesn't matter. Exact. Lethal. Delete it. And most of the game, those games were with only two lands.
So is this guy a pint or a pint? Or a pant? I don't know. I do not know. We'll play the Vanguard first. This way, our Enti will... I mean, it, it'd just be a short video, I guess. Two lands, but we're taking it. It's been working. And uh, the thought of getting Talia down, especially if he's in those colors, heckin' right. Heckin' yeah. Opera the Nine. Playing probably a reenact the crime deck. Absolutely a reenact the crime deck. So Talia is going to come in super clutch to slow him down. Super clutch. But, again, um, I have a 41% chance to draw land. I would like that to happen next turn, please. I have another one. That's fine. And as of right now, I'm not drawing any lands, so... This is all I'm doing. However, it is looking like, unless something changes really quickly, like, um, I don't know, like I draw a land or something from this, I would like to draw a land from this, please. Um, we are going to drop him. Yes! Uh, Yes, sir. Give me that land. Thanks. I'll be I mean, it means that we're just good for now. He's already dropped three of his Kaitos, so what if we just go ahead and... So my thinking here is that he will not be able to discard with that bad boy. His, his him attacking is not a problem here. That's not his goal. Okay, one, two, three, four Kaitos. Four Kaitos in his first fifteen. Tell me that is not beautiful for him. Um. He's not really good right now because I'm not going to be... Maybe we just go ahead and drop her. And then attack with, attack with the Talia alone. And at this point, uh, I think we're going to... And I can play the, Lu uh, the Lunark Veteran. So, that's cool. Alright, I'm happy with where we're at right now, except for the fact that he's got that. The good news is, is he, that, that puts him at one mana, and uh, I'm almost wide enough to just attack out. Like, you can't, can't cast anything, really. I don't think you have anything that is one mana. And now I'm drawing all the lands. So... I think we play him and just attack out. What would that be? Oh, doesn't matter. Eight and two, baby. Eight and two. Eighty percent. Mardu humans. Uh, this looks good. On the play. 
I'm very happy. I am very a freaking happy. Looks like he's having to shuffle. Absolutely. Oh, look at that. He's down to five. And I've got what seems like the nuts. Let's go. Well, maybe not the nuts, but at least one of them. I've got one of them. Go ahead and get our Talia down, so whatever he's got going on there is not playable anymore. Ooh, it's a double strike deck. Okay. I'm just going to attack with her. so nice to have. He's probably about ready to hit me for like 10. But I'm going to be honest with you. I'm at 7 wins already. If we lost this one, you know, my goal every time is 7 and 3. <clears throat> um, doesn't matter because where he has uh, trample, it doesn't matter. Yep. The best I can do now is hope that we can race a little bit. I will get rid of my Talia. Give that to him. Blast him for a bunch. And I'm really hoping at this point that uh, he doesn't have what he needs. Let's go. Come on. I'm going to be honest with you, that looks like a win to me. Eight and two, as I predicted accurately. Let's go. Deleted the shuffler. I deleted the shuffler. All right. I hope you enjoyed those games. You know that I did. And if you stuck around to the end here, I greatly appreciate you. And if you haven't subbed yet, please consider doing so. The button's right there. And hit that notification bell because I am going live now and I wouldn't want you to miss that. If you aren't convinced yet, I got plenty of videos out for you. You can check out maybe this one here or this one here and maybe find something you like. I've got plenty here for you. So until next time, take care and I hope that you have the most wonderful of days.